Hey, what's happening? It's your girl Zanetta. Welcome to my channel, Zanetta Loves You. I am doing a vlog of my weight loss journey. I got this idea from my dad. He told me since you're doing this again, the second time around, you should most definitely document this so other people can join you or um, get inspired. And also just to show proof, like living proof that it can be done naturally. Um, and just by eating healthy and working out, portion control and whatnot. This vlogging idea of putting everything in one video from Beck underscore 21. Shout out girl for the great idea of just smushing everything together. Every week or every other week I'll be posting like a week video, like a daily vlog for that week or every two weeks. We'll, we'll figure it out. In November, December, I was at 285 freaking pounds. That is the biggest I've ever been. Always been a big girl, always been that fat girl who has all these badass friends who have natural coke body, you know, big booty and all that stuff in that group since elementary. That That's just crazy to me because that's like so close to 300 pounds and I'm only 4'11", so I really look fat as hell. Like I'm chunky, like, and my fupa is like hella big now so it's like bitch get a grip now bitch is trying to get a grip <sighs> that's sick with covid december 24th uh 2020 and by a co-worker an ex-co-worker former co-worker whatever um she didn't tell us that she had covid it's facts that she knew because COVID doesn't just disappear in a week, honey. So it's a fact that you knew that you were sick and then you told us last minute and it's like everything, you, you know, that's just a whole different story time. But anyways, I got sick and it paused. Yeah, that's another story time. So anyways, we're talking about ways and that I don't get into it and get mad. So I got sick and because I lost my taste and sm sent, uh, sense of smell, I didn't really want to eat. I was like, there's no point in eating in and out. There's no point in eating anything with taste, um, any meat or anything, if it's just gonna taste like nothing, like literally nothing. I was just like, just might as well eat healthy. I wouldn't be hungry because I couldn't taste. Like, I'm just like, I'm not gonna eat at all. Well, that's how it started. And then I met this guy and he was like, what's your goal? Like, we, you know, small talk, da, 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 da. I posted like, oh my God, I can't wait until I get this way again. I posted old photos of me. And then he was like, what's your goal? I was like, oh, um, da, 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 da. And he was just like, cool, cool. Well, like, you know, let's work out together or whatever. I was like, oh, I got COVID. Like, <laughs> you know, like can't meet anybody. Don't infect anybody because, you know, I care. He was like, all right, well, I got some workouts. Basically, it's sound beautiful no matter what, but if that's your goal, like, we can get it done so he sends me workouts he tells me what to do and boom i'm here now when i weighed in with him january 5th um 2020 21 i was 260 no 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 sorry 271 pounds and then i weighed in last week I texted him my weight, and last Saturday, I was 268.8, or 269, no, 268, it was 268, he was like, okay, cool, cool, the workouts that he provided, that he sent me, were, like, just crazy, so, I, like, took hella breaks, just gonna be completely honest, I took hella breaks, during my workouts because I was just like whoa five minutes of each like um and I'm a vegetarian and doing low carbs and I can't eat past six like oh I'm gonna get a headache or something's gonna happen so you know I took it really easy the first week like I see progress like I'm not as tired when doing the workouts but I still haven't done them consistently like five minutes straight without stopping but it's getting there and I'm going at my own pace and I'm seeing results like I'm losing weight I feel energetic I feel healthy 
and I know I will get there soon. I do see a major result in walking and running. I was walking a mile, I forget, but I'll post it. These are my results from walking a mile and then jogging and walk, walking and then jogging and ending with a walk and then starting with a jog, walk and then ending it with a jog. So these are my results right here and I'm just super proud of myself. Like I'm getting back into it. So um, week three, which is next week, um, I am going to most definitely try to bust them all out. I just have to hear, find a good five minute song. You know, I do want to lose like two to three pounds a week. So this Saturday will be my actual goal weight and we'll see. And I'll come back and let you guys know. Alrighty, I love you, bye. Good morning, y'all. I'm about to go ahead and get my workout in. Um, I hate that. Shut the fuck up. Sometimes I feel like they're doing this shit on purpose. You feel me? Anyways, um, I'm going to just be honest. Oh, today is... It's Friday and tomorrow's weigh-in day. And I'm going to be honest, I haven't been putting 100% in my workouts. And let me tell you why. Because I've been doing the 80-20 rule. 80% of uh, eating healthy and then 20% of working out. Um, his workouts are super hard. But I know I'm going to get into them. I know I'm going to accomplish in one of these days it's been cold outside like cold rainy misty and i'm not trying to get sick again and i live upstairs in an apartment so i can't do the workouts in the house because people downstairs <sighs> so it's been like workout and then two days of no working out and then workout and then no workout and then workout because it's just been really cold and i'm just so afraid of getting sick again and i don't want to get sick so today i am going to try my best get it in burn some calories and i ate a good big breakfast this morning because all the other days for two weeks i've been eating really really small but hella like vegetables and some carbs here and there um and a lot of fruit so it, i just haven't hit my calorie point if that makes sense so me working now i tried to do that for one week and i kind of got headaches and I woke up like angry and hungry and frustrated because I didn't like feel my body. So like I didn't balance my calorie count to my, you know, workout. So I'm trying to figure that out. But today we're going to we're going to get it in. And these five minute workouts. <laughs> I just don't want to think about it like that. So I have to play some music that's going to make me do these things for five minutes. Weigh ins tomorrow morning. So let's go ahead and check that out good morning today is saturday and it's weigh-in day i feel super bloated because i ate cheese yesterday oh i'm so scared what it would say on the scale let's go check it out okay y'all so today is weigh-in day and i'm super nervous so we're just going to be ghetto and put it on the um, portrait mode and put it on the, uh, what you call it? extremely happy that I didn't gain any weight and I lost it because I've been working hard as fudge okay all I gotta do so I've been doing good on my eating all I have to do is just put 100% in my workout so let's be completely honest I only put like 25 20 to 25 to 50 percent in my workouts um the running is easy I'm getting a little bit faster it's just you know squats working out is easy it's just like mentally oh my gosh five minutes each workout it's like draining and mentally draining so i gotta get that out of my head i don't like counting it because when i count it i get stressed so i'm trying to like figure out new ways to not get stressed or just like to mentally block it because like doing workouts is no problem but when they put like a time or not even time but like numbers like just like the reps how many reps i just like 
this is gonna take forever like that's all i think of and i need to get that out my head and build my mind up you feel me i gotta be mentally strong and when i first lost weight my dad always said strengthen your mind before you strengthen your body because in order to strengthen that body and lose that weight and tone this has to be there and right now this is not here right now for for the reps i have no problem doing the workouts but the mindset of the reps like damn five minutes of it bro like i can do two minutes i can do two minutes a minute to two minutes but when they said five minutes, I'm like, damn, I could do three minutes because I can do a whole song. But it's like, two more minutes? I need to find a song that's five minutes. <laughs> Today's my rest day, but I'm going to go run or walk. I, I, I can't just rest. Like, I'm always like that. Once I start working out, I just can't have a rest day. Like, I know you're supposed to rest your body once, at least once, so everything could just rejuvenate or whatever. But, like, I need to move around. Like, I'm so energetic. Like, I just can't sit down anymore. And then my mind starts telling me, bitch, you're fat. Get the fuck up. So, <laughs> my mind tells me, there's no fucking rest day, bitch. Get the fuck up, okay? Ooh, bitch, okay, Zanetta. I got you. I got you, bitch. It's like, okay, bitch. You better. You better. But that's how it is. <laughs> All right, y'all. Oh my god, this dang thorny. You know, stay tuned. This is week two, so week three. I'll be posting every other week. Okay. Or weekly. I'm not sure. Thank you for your support and everything. Oh, and my online store is open. I am alive and healthy. So if you guys want to book an appointment for your makeup services, go ahead. I got a deal going on. And so um lip gloss, got a deal, hand sanitizers. Um, I have lashes and many more will come soon. All right, guys. I love you. Bye. Tell me the scram. I'm sipping gas in the test of fucking lamp. She throwing half a man text it where you been. But you don't respect him. I don't know why she went him. Hey, she don't even know. But fuck that. She go throw down on the flow. I hit the 111 dance and I pose. I hit the 111 dance and I'm close. Hit out the park. She just hopped on and start. I deliver, I ain't talking, it's the cart. I can tell you apart from the rest, you a mark. Ayy, I'm a shark. I'm excited, now she living when she walk. I know this world, bitch, I'm living large. Ayy, 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 ayy. Everything large. From the crib to the money to the cars. Everything large. From the crib to the money to the cars. <laughs>